Hello, today's video is on our stock number 35715MD, uh, DC speed control and direction controller board. As you can see, it is just a, a board level component, uh, no box, no enclosure, so you must mount it, protect it. Uh, as you can see, let's get into the size, is 3 inches by just, uh, just under 2 inches, 1 and 13 sixteenths. You can see by these one inch squares. It has about a seven inch wire lead to the joystick. Uh, that's what's unique about this part. It, it does use a joystick for controlling direction. Uh, it is rated from 12 volts DC to 30 volts DC. That, that 30 volts is a maximum. Uh, running current is about three amps uh, with about, uh, ooh, let's see, at 12 volts they say a 50 watt max. Uh, that's for a very short time. That's a little over four amps and at 24 volts DC, it's a 100 watt max, which there again is just slightly more than 4 amps. So that's that's just a temporary surge. Uh, let's see what else we got here about a duty cycle from 0 to 100%. Um, if you find out the motor when you first hook it up is spinning, you need to quite zero the pot out. You have an adjustment pot right here that you can do that with. Nice, nice little feature to, to zero it out. Uh, this is your input power leads. Uh, obviously that you must get the polarity correct or you'll damage the unit. But for your motor output, uh, you can flip them back and forth if you want to. If you find out it's not going in the right direction or you could simply turn the pot around either way. Uh, so let, let's get to it here. This is a 5K pot. Center, it's spring loaded back to center. So every time you release it, uh, it will just go back to zero. And as you can see, as you slow, I'm going to do this at an angle so you can see it here. It's only in one direction. And I believe this is what the y-axis, or you can mount it sideways, and that would be the z-axis. But uh, all depending on how you mount it. So let's get started. Let me show you a side here. As you slowly... Okay, that is how it works. That's how it operates. Every time I, I think I've seen every possible motor controller, they come out with something new. So like I say, a single axis joystick controller for your motor. DC motor only. Uh, hopefully this uh, explains a little bit more about the unit to you. Um, that should be it. Thank you for watching our video.